The Fano Science Center is an interactive science center in Wolfsburg, Germany, completed in 2005. Fano arose from urban planning by the city of Wolfsburg. In 1998 city officials were developing a plot of vacant, public land immediately adjacent to Wolfsburg's railway station and just south of VW's huge, then unfinished attraction Autostadt. An art museum was planned for the site, but Dr. Wolfgang Guthart, then the city's director for culture, sports and education, knew that such an institution would compete with Wolfsburg's successful Kunstmuseum art museum and needed other options. Guthart visited Technorama, a science center in Switzerland and became convinced that a science center in Wolfsburg would complement both Autostadt and the Kunstmuseum. Preliminary planning began in November 1998, and one year later Joe Ansel, an American consultant and designer, was approached to handle the exhibitions and other operational aspects of the project. An architectural design competition was held in January 2000 and the prominent architect Zaha Hadid won, in conjunction with structural engineers, Adams Kara Taylor. About five years later, Fano opened to the public on November 24, 2005 with over 250 interactive exhibits from Ansel Associates, Inc. all enclosed in an astounding concrete structure designed by Zaha Hadid, her German associate, Mayer Barley Architects and Adams Kara Taylor. The architectural design has been described as a hypnotic work of architecture, the kind of building that utterly transforms our vision of the future." The design won a 2006 Reba European Award as well as the 2006 Institution of Structural Engineers Award for Arts, Leisure and Entertainment Structures. The building stands on concrete stilts, allowing visitors to the Autostat to pass through without interfering with the workings of the building. Fano is connected to the Autostat by a metal bridge accessed by escalators and stairs either side. The underside of Fano and the stilts are illuminated. Dr. Guthart is now Fano's first executive director. Fano has enjoyed high attendance and broad public acceptance since its grand opening. The Science Center has a theme song, Phenomenal which was written and performed by American singer-songwriter Amanda Somerville for the opening. The Fano was included on a list of the Seven Wonders of the Modern World objects built since 2000 by The Financialist. <laughs> <laughs> Movie appearances The Fano appears in the movie The International as headquarters of an Italian weapons company, digitally inserted in front to a cliff at the Iseo Lake. The Fano also appears in the German disaster film, B-movie Helden, when Dean Land Dick Braut as a Large Hadron Collider. <laughs> 